Hello everyone, and I'm here to show you a neat little app called FaceTalker. You can see it right down here. It does say just FaceTalk, but the app itself is actually called FaceTalker. When I open this up, what it allows me to do is it allows me to put any picture in there and actually have the mouth move according to the way uh, that you're talking. So when you talk, it will record your voice and actually kind of make the mouth move. So it's pretty cool. Um, so for example, let's say we're doing a unit on history and we're going to talk about George Washington. So here he is. Um, I could save this picture. So I can click Save Picture. Then I'm going to switch back over to my Face Talker. I want to get my picture from my photo album. I can see there's good old George there. All I have to do is get his face kind of into that outline. I can just do kind of pinch and pull to make it fit. Pick the mouth that works best for it. Looks like uh, George wasn't having the best day that day. Kind of little frowny face there. I can pick that and hit done. So now you can see I'm talking and his mouth will move according to how I talk. So let's hit done. And now you see this is kind of a preview of what it will look like. And all I have to do at this point is hit record and it will actually record my voice. So you would want to make sure you have maybe some soundbite facts that you'd want to use. So this is kind of a cool way that you could have um, George Washington actually present facts on himself to the class. So if I hit record, here are seven fun facts about George Washington. I didn't start school until I was six. I got married at age 26. I was six feet two inches tall. Cream of potato soup, oh actually cream of peanut soup was my favorite. I uh, had a lot of hound dogs. I had toothaches until I was 57 when I had all my teeth pulled out. And also, I planned the new capital city, Washington, D.C., but I never got to live there. So now what it's doing is actually just playing back uh, the video I just did. So I could actually see that in there. Now if I was happy with it, all I had to do is click the kind of universal send to button right there. And what it's doing right now at this point is it's creating my video. So you just gotta give it a little while and it will kinda go and go and go. Um, but eventually what you do is you have the option to do a couple different things. You can email it to someone. You can save it onto your photo reel so that would be directly on your iPad. Um, and most of these are going to be dictating about how long the video is. If it's 20 minutes long, you're not really going to be able to email that to someone. But as long as it's normally under about 5 minutes, you can kind of email it to someone and you should be pretty okay. And we can see it's wrapping up. It's going to look kind of funky just because right now I have it reflecting. But here is an email version. So I emailed this to my computer. And so I just have it directly on my computer. And this is one I did a little bit earlier. So it's kind of a cooking show here. So you can see it actually looks pretty good. And it works really well. So that's FaceTalker. FaceTalker is a really pretty cool app. Lots of different things that you could do with it. Lots of great potential. Um, and I just wanted to show you that and hope you enjoy it.